Only be open to... Oh, sorry. <laughs> there we go. What's it going to be? Seed of Life. Not bad. Is there anything else on this little island? I mean, it's actually part of the bigger continent, but it's sort of, uh, you know, as you can see, separated. Uh, I'll be right back when I just check the map a second. And right, okay, I know where the next chest is on this area. It's just a little bit further. In fact, I'm going the wrong way. What a lovely morning it is. Honestly, one of the best day-night cycles in any game ever. Ooh, a robo-robin. Puppet. What was that? Puppet Masters? Okay, we'll take you on. Um, you're damn right, we'll take you on. In fact, we'll show off the Falcon Slash. Oh, he's got high defense. Ooh, I like the Falcon Slash. That is nice. Uh-oh. And that beep tells me I've been recording for nearly an hour. That's good. Boosh, right, he's down. Out for the count. Funny story. Oh, I've heard that one. Oh, it's brilliant. <laughs> Only Mage and Yangus didn't get it. Oh, a love story. Mage isn't watching. Yangus thinks it's hilarious. <laughs> When's the love story supposed to be hilarious? <laughs> oh, I breathed, breathed too heav heavily down the mic there. I'm sorry. I got carried away with the uh, excellent storytelling on display. These guys are actually pretty tough. Oh, come on, kill the damn guy. Thank you, Jessica. Level 22, you deserve that. You did deserve that. Put those in staves, of course. Right, so yeah, if we just carry on heading this way, there should be a chest in that general direction. So, let's... Oh, in fact, ding, we have our new spear. Look at that sexy beast. The Holy Lance is ours. Alrighty, so, while we're waiting for, uh... Because the boomerang is going to be the next main thing I'm going to make, but until we get the ingredients for it, we're going to be putting... some more Moonwarp bulbs. Which I bought a shit ton of, off-screen. Where are they? There they are. There we go. So I'll always have something cooking that's useful. So let's see what this holy holy lance is going to be like. So 130 attack. That's pretty nice. I'm going to equip that for now. And look how... Oh, that just looks so nice. Damn. I like it. One of my favourite looking weapons in the game, actually. Alright, so anyway, we need to uh, head down this hill. Uh, more of these guys. Well, we'll see what this spear can do against them.
if we get a chance to attack ever, you know, be nice. Here we go. Yeah, it doesn't really show it off brilliantly because they have such high defense, but it is a pretty damn nice spear. So let's try that again. these guys. Anything with high defense, I mean, just really, oh dear. Ouch. Yeah, should think so. Ever since, you know, playing blue and red Pokemon, fighting those damn Metapods that just used to use Harden, took forever to kill them. That's, uh, soured me on high defense enemies. Oh, he's gonna blow up as well, is he? No originality in these enemies, you know. There we go. We killed one of them legitimately. So, according to the map I have, a chest should be over here somewhere. Maybe an infamous monster as well. Ooh, bomb boulders. Okay. I'm not really having to skip many uh, skip many fights because they're all pretty new enemies. I just should have healed. I should have healed. That was silly. That was really silly. Okay, Angelo, please. You have to heal. I feel probably Yangus. Oh crap! I can see these guys doing some serious damage. I don't know why Yangus would, uh, and, and Angelo snigger and laugh at a love story. Surely the funny story should get that sort of, oh no, hallucinating. Yangus, please stop laughing. Oh god. This is not going well. Still heal. In fact, I should have healed himself. Oh, come on. That was ridiculous. One hit. It's supposed to, you know, it's multi thrust, not one hit thrust. Alright, at least that's. No, oh, no, it's still not dead. I thought it was dead. Crap. Jessica needs healing, and Angelo does, so Mage is going to have to uh, take up healing responsibilities. Uh, why did that do not do anything? Ugh. Shit. Uh, in fact, I'm going to use a Moon's Mercy on Jessica. Yeah, this is going to just uh, try and kill one of these mofos. Angelo is going to heal her. Uh, himself, rather, yes. I've made those moons mercies. I might as well use them. Mercy. Oh, shit. The one time Angelo doesn't get a spell off quickly. Oh, no. Oh, this is not going well. Stop grinning maliciously. I'm gonna have to run. I'm gonna have to try and run. I don't think I can win this. Not if everyone keeps freaking laughing. I'm running. Oh man. That was terrible. 
Those bombs are awful. They dodged everything and defense and oh no. And that means we don't have Angelo with us, our main healer. Which kinda sucks. So I'm gonna try and find this uh this chest, and then I'm gonna have to zoom back to an inn or something or a church. Is that an enemy I see? I think it is. That's an infamous monster, and there's the chest. Magic dumbbells. Well, I would fight you guys, but I don't think I'd win. <laughs> you see the coffin there. Yeah, the glitch isn't work isn't happening anymore. Usually that would be all black and stuff. That's good. And uh, at the moment, I can't make uh, revival items yet. Mon oh, more blooming. What are these? Kijabawa. Oh, Jabberwocky. Okay. <laughs> Well, I am just going to run for now, get this chest, and we can always come back and kick their asses when we're more prepared. And that is an iron mask, which we're going to give to someone. Probably gonna end up giving that to Yangus. Yeah. And can we give the crown to anyone else? No. Okay, fine. Just out of curiosity, what about the uh, bronze armor? No. Okay. Right, I need to zoom back to somewhere safe. Probably gonna be. I think the hilltop hut, because it's free to sleep there. So let's chat to this. Oh, in fact, no, we want Angelo back first. Two hundred and fifty gold. I think the amount of money you have to pay depends on uh, how much health the character actually has. And there he is. I don't want to resurrect again. Anyway, uh, I'm going to cut to when I've rested fully, and we'll see if we shouldn't start heading towards the actual story part of the map. Okay, so we're back on uh, on Sean, and we're going to head towards where I think we're supposed to be going. The the west, of course, is where we last heard uh, what's-his-face, the um, Dulmagus was headed, so we're going to try and follow him. There are a bunch of other chests I've missed, um, and one platinum sword that I think you might be able to get at this point, but the enemies around them may be a bit too dangerous. So I'm going to leave it for now, and we're just going to head where I think we're supposed to be going. Ooh, wild boar fish. Haven't seen you before, have we? If we have, I do apologise. If not, let's kill them. really excited about getting this new boomerang. Hopefully we'll get it quite soon. We will have a whole new continent to explore very shortly, that much is certain. Mage is poisoned again, is he? Antidotal herb, well that is perfect. I'm going to use said herb. There we go. So, 
I think you're supposed to head under this sort of stony, you know, rock formation bridge type thing. I'm sure there's a technical term for it. I may have learned it in geography at school, but I can't for the life of me recall what it is. It's basically a door that's opened up. Speaking of which, I've been to Durdle Door. That's a very famous example. Not sure if it's exactly the same as this, but hey. Hawkman! Too stunned to move. Well, that's perfect then. We're going to get some psychop action going on here. And unleash hell. Yeah, Dirtle Door is a place down south on the south coast of England. Can't remember exactly which uh, county it's in for the life of me, but I've been there a few times. Not that it's really that interesting to you guys, but hey. Got to come up with some sort of commentary. And you'll notice there is a settlement on top of this sort of uh, bridge, you could call it. And I do believe that is actually Baccarat. However you say it. Oh, here we go, Sea Dragon. Now, I'm sure we've heard of this guy before, briefly. And uh, I'm not sure if this will be the last we see of him. But we've got to fight him, I think. And he's pretty tough. Giga Flash. Ouch. Well, and we're uh, enveloped in illusions. That probably means we're going to be missing a hell of a lot. Yep. Um, don't think this is going to go well. I'm going to go for the, uh, no, actually, just the Mercurial Thrust. Right, no, Multi-Thrust, yeah. Yeah. Going to miss it anyway, but we might as well have as many attacks as possible. See? Ah, oh, for God's sake. I don't think we can actually hurt it, then, when we're enveloped in illusion, can we? Oh no, we can, it's just really low chance. So that's fantastic. How do we cure ourselves of this? Oh, but we kill him anyway. That's alright. And that is a scripted fight, I think. When you pass under there for the first time, you just always encounter that guy. But uh, do I see a lighthouse or a church or a chapel or something there? I think I do, but we're just gonna have a quick heal. Ah, uh, more of these guys. And, oh yeah, Yangus and Mage are poisoned. Let's see if we can't land right next to this church. Ooh! We have another Moon's Mercy. Might as well stick some more Moonwalk bulbs in the old pot. Always have something in there. There we go. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. What have I done? What did I do then? I was looking at the uh, damn screen for a second. I was just pressing buttons. 
Yes. Here we go. Okay. Can we land anywhere near this place? Or are we going to have to go the long way around? I have a feeling we're going to have to go the long way around. Oh no, we can disembark there. Fantastic. And you'll notice this looks a little bit different to what we used to. The grass is a different colour. Because it's a whole new continent and probably different weather and all sorts of things. And I see a chest already. What a wonderful greeting. Welcoming gift. Oh, and just slimes. Okay. And, uh, well, the slimes merged together to form the uh, the king, so I thought they might as well just show me taking him down. Be rude not to. I love that uh, Angelo's got a decent attack now. That falcon thing is bloody awesome. Multi heal, oh crap. Now, from him, of course, you do have a very rare chance of getting another slime crown, but. We're not that lucky, but I wasn't really expecting it. I see uh, a little monk chap, friar type dude there. Let's speak to the chest. Let's speak to the chest. Open the chest. We can speak to it if we want to. But oh, tough guy tattoo. Now that is used in another recipe with that gold rosary that we don't have anymore. Uh, I think it would make a holy talisman, which protects against de uh, instant death attacks. But, uh, oh, I see another chest. But I didn't really want to go for that. Hello. Actually built for a place, as a place for travelling pilgrims to rest f for the night. See, no reason to offer a bed. No, no reason not to offer. A okay. Thanks. Hello. It's a clear sunny day, just like today. That's when I, he saw it. What do you mean, what? That man running across the sea, of course. Ah, well, let's have a chat to the uh, the guy inside. See if we can't get any leads. And uh, actually, is that? Are you not going to say anything? Oh, hang on. <laughs> I was going to say I could use an inn. If you follow the road in front of the church, you'll soon see that this, this town called Baccarat. There's really a, a, there's a really big casino there. But there's something a bit weird going on. It used to be open every day of the year, but it's suddenly been shut down. Oh, well, that's disappointing. I wonder what problem has arisen that we're going to have to sort out. And nothing in this tower. Although, a very nice view. Let's search your wardrobes. Another mini medal. You must be exhausted, why don't you stay here for a while? Yes. Now, let's see, did you see anything about this chap? Ah, not been able to sleep a wink. No one expects to see a jester come running across the sea like that. Suppose not. Right, so he is headed there, is he? All right. Aw, oh, poor little kid. Then again, seeing Trode probably won't help him much. Oh, blimey! Awesome. <laughs> right, well thanks for the uh, the tip. Tip off there, little, little lad. 
Let's say you're a dab hand with the old sword. You can't use the special skills you learnt with it. Yes, yes, yes. See if it's sometimes best to hang on to your old weapon, even if you've gone and got yourself a new one. I know that. What about you, fancy looking woman? Skills are new techniques you learn, skills are new discoveries, skills are the souvenirs you collect on this rich journey that we call life. Got any questions about skills? Alright, learn about skills, points to the next level. Oh, interesting. Don't really need it, considering I have a book that tells me all that stuff. But uh, we'll do it anyway. Mage, which of your skills would you like to hear about? Uh, I'll go for spears. Rank 7 out of a total 10. You need another 10 points to reach next spear skill level, okay. No, that's fine. But it's nice to know that you can consult this woman if you need uh, need some skill tutelage. Right, so that's that place. Can we zoom there now? Is that a new destination for us? Sea View, Sea View Church, yes it is, good, and we're probably going to be heading back there quite a lot uh, from here on in, so let's, um, let me just see, can we, uh, that chest is quite a way away and it's on a different sort of island. We have a fair distance to travel until we reach Baccarat, I fear, so I shall uh, just take a quick break.